Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel or welcome if this is your first time tuning in. My name is Orlando and on this channel we talk about fragrances and in today's video I am sharing with you uh, my top five most worn fragrances of uh, March 2024. So today is the 31st of March and I'm just going to show you the ones that I've been wearing the most this month. So starting at number five spot, I have Tonka Imperial by Guerlain. And this one is a sweet almondy fragrance with a woody, a slightly smoky uh, background. Really, um, really, really incredible and um, an amazing uh, uh, fragrance, an amazing smell. Uh, unfortunately, is now discontinued. But I think you can still get it in, um, um, you can request it to have it in the B bottles uh, and because I still have the, the juice so you can still get it. So yeah, it's an incredible fragrance. I have won, won it three times this month. That is Tonka Imperial by Guerlain. Coming at number four, I've also won this one three times and that is Oud Maracuja by Maison Crivelli and this one opens with this very realistic zingy juicy uh, passion fruit note um, and this then so well blended with uh, a leathery oud accord uh, an absolute stunning fragrance I love this I just love this combination of uh, this fruitiness and oudy um, accord it's just so beautiful uh, super long lasting uh, and um, super projecting as well and you only need like one to two sprays maximum of this one absolutely great and um, really enjoying it at the minute it's Oud Maracuja by Maison Crivelli and coming at number three spot I have Podcast Blue The Extrait de Parfum by Ex Nihilo and this one it's kind of a woody warm spicy and slightly sweet um fragrance as well so the dry down it's kind of a sweet uh woody fragrance but with another note of um a nude accord um and this one um that's what that's what uh, sets this one apart from the oud de parfum version is the oud accord that it has which is really amazing in this fragrance i love this uh this is the same perfumer behind oud maracuja which is jordi fernandez uh but this one was released uh first if i'm not mistaken this yes this is a 2022 uh release oud maracuja is 2023 release um so yeah this is um absolutely amazing i'm not saying that they are um similar fragrances but they have that oud night that is um kind of in this in in the two fragrances and this by the same uh, perfumer so yeah an incredible uh, fragrance uh, i absolutely love this and uh, yeah i've won it four times this month um incredible um great podcast blue by ex nihilo coming at number two spot i have parfum de marli altair and this one it's kind of a, I get this kind of floral, fresh opening, and then you, it kind of dries down to this dusty vanilla fragrance. So you, you get vanilla and also like cacao powder. Um, it's really interesting because it's a vanilla fragrance, but it's not a sweet vanilla fragrance. It's only very slightly sweet. It's more like I find it more to be a creamy um, and dry uh, vanilla, like a vanilla powder, uh, but it's creamy at the same time. It's like an uh, ice cream, but with a bit of powder, if that makes sense. It's very difficult to explain, but yeah, uh, really interesting. I love this fragrance, uh, and I've worn it five times this month. Incredible. It's um, Parfum de Marly Altair. And Coming at number one spot, this might be no surprise, is Chandigarh Express by uh, Ex Nihilo. 
and this is a fruity aromatic fresh leather fragrance and it's just absolutely gorgeous it's got the slightly sweetness on as it dries down but it's only very slightly but the main uh, player here is this leather cord that it has and it's just an absolutely addictive um, and memorable fragrance as well I absolutely love this I think this is um, my new signature scent to be honest um, I haven't had a signature scent for a while but this is becoming uh, my signature scent and I've worn it nine times this month it's incredible if you haven't tried this one yet you gotta have to try it really an amazing fragrance i love this is shandigar express by ex nihilo and that is it for me today i uh, hope you guys have enjoyed this list and uh, if you have please do give this video a thumbs up and also consider subscribing to my channel i would very much appreciate that and uh, thank you so much for watching and i hope to see you in my next one Bye-bye.